What is yield? Yield refers to the amount of income that an investment generates over time. It is calculated by adding interest or dividends to the investment and then dividing it by the investment's value. It is usually expressed in an annual percentage and does not include capital gains. However, it's important not to confuse yield and return. The return on investment, or ROI, is usually referred to as profit and loss, and that's not the same as yield. There are a few different contexts where yield can be used. It's possible to define yield in a more precise way if a qualifier is added to it, such as current yield, dividend yield, or yield maturity. Some common investments used for calculating yield are stocks, bonds, and real estate. So, how do we calculate yield? Simply put, the percent yield formula calculates the annual income-only return of investment by putting income in the numerator and cost, or the market price in the denominator. So yield equals annual income over investment value. We then use this formula doing the following steps to calculate yield. We calculate the initial investment or market value of the stock or bond, calculate the amount of income from the investment, divide the market value by the income, and multiply this number by 100 to get the percentage. Let's take a look at bonds. Bonds have an interest yield. Bond investors receive income in the form of coupon payments. These can vary in frequency but are usually semi-annual. Bonds make things more difficult. There are many ways to calculate bond yield, and it depends on factors like how long the bond is held, the coupon or interest rate, and whether it's fixed or variable. Let's look at an example. Let's say you want to save your money and you decide to buy some bonds. You want to buy a government bond with a coupon of 5%, and it currently costs $900. The par value is 1000 What is the yield of this bond? To calculate yield, first we look at calculating income. Income would be 5% of the $1,000 face value, or $50 per year. We then take the $50 and divide it by the price, or the market value, of 900 and we get 0 0.056. To calculate that and convert it into a percentage, we multiply by 100, so we get 5.56%. Let's next look at dividend yield for stocks. Dividends are the source of income for stockholders. Although the frequency of dividends varies, it's often quarterly. Stockholders get yield from stocks. Dividends are a form of income that is paid over a regular period, and dividends can be used to calculate yield. Let's look at the percent yield formula for a dividend paying stock by using an example. Here, let's look at a stock that we want to buy that costs $100. It pays a quarterly dividend of a dollar. So what's the current dividend yield? We take the dollar, multiply by 4, since it's quarterly, to get the annual payment in, in, or income of $4. The $4 we divide by the stock price, which is 0 0.04, and then convert it to a percentage by multiplying by 100, so it's 4%. So the current dividend yield is 4%. It's not difficult to calculate the yield of an investment's value with some basic math. Learn to calculate yield so you can understand the income you get from your investments. Mm -hmm.